Hey everyone, this is Grace. Hope you've been well. I was actually not planning on filming this video, but uh, my very first order from housemouse.com right here arrived, and I want to share it with you as well as a promotion that's going on. So, um, yeah, because it is very time sensitive, the sale is only up until I think Monday night. So, um, you guys know I am a big House Mouse stamps fan and i can't remember but a number of you actually alerted me to this and i know certainly deb um told me about this as well so when you go onto this website you'll not only get you know the stamps the wooden stamps the cling stamps but all this other merchandise related to house mouse they have tote bags and anyway so i resisted because i was thinking oh no 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 stay away you're okay with just the stamps but then um i recently received an email oh incidentally for those of you who are wondering how do i color these little mice um, when you go onto this site they actually have a whole section devoted to um coloring um individual mice and um a little narrative about each of the mice so it's really cute anyway so I am on their um, email list and I ended up receiving this email saying that a number of their items were 50% off and so you know I hemmed and hawed and I was like yeah but the shipping you know how shipping always gets us right well this weekend and this is the reason why I'm filming this video this weekend I think up until Monday there is a $5 off of $25 or more purchase. And as you can see, um, what I did was the $5, the first range of shipping is I think like, I can't remember, it's either $3.99. Anyway, $5.99 was the range that I was looking at. And you can spend up to $30 and still have that shipping rate of $5.99. And so I thought, hey, the $5 will go off of that, so it basically makes the shipping $0.99, cents, and then I get all of these for 50% off. So that was kind of the rationale why I ended up making this purchase. And let me share this with you in case some of you want to um, order these. They are magnetic on the back, and um, they also have post-it notes, um, and those are like under a dollar fifty. These, I think, for the majority of these were like a dollar. There you go, a dollar eighty-seven, as you can see. So let me quickly go through and show you these. So I think there's like fifty sheets, and then I love this so much. I ended up getting three. And take a look, how cute are these? And then I loved this. So yeah, I bought duplicates because I wanted to gift these oh, isn't it so cute I love how there's like designs here and all the way throughout yes but I ended up getting some extras because I wanted to have them to give out as gifts so did that and isn't this so darling I love this one obviously great for Christmas like stocking stuffers can't you right so so cute and then the last one is this so I thought that these would be really cute because from time to time when I send notes to people, I like to just take cute little stationery and just jot down a, you know, short little note. And then what was really nice as you whoa, sorry, as you guys can see here is it says thanks for your order. Here is a free 2019 pocket calendar. So it's so nice because it has this nice kind of laminated cover. And I'm just going to show you in case. So I think my suspicion is if you place an order too, they may end up throwing a, you know, pocket calendar for you as well. But, yep, so now this gives you an idea of what other stamps are out there for us to have. Right, I have this one. I don't think I have this one, so that would be a really great one to have. And my... How I'm going to be using this is I'll keep it in my little wristlet just so that I can take check dates. Actually, you know what? This would actually be a really good desk calendar to have because I don't have a little desk calendar right now. Then that way I won't be inclined to mark on it too. And this will just be a keepsake that I um, keep. <laughs> I do that with the Thomas Kincaid engagement calendars as well. 
How cute are they? So, so cute. Now, they do sell this separately. Um, I think it's, I can't remember the price because obviously I was more interested in the grocers list. And the reason why these are smaller is, as you guys can tell, it says Junior Grocery Lister, which I think is great because the, you know, regular size grocery list for me is too big. And so this is really nice because then you can really maximize the paper real estate. <laughs> Aren't these adorable? Oh my goodness, so cute. I bet that's Monica. Yep, there's Monica up there. And then these little guys. I think that's Muzzy and Maxwell, right? And then this one. And then voila. So really pretty. And then there it is. But anyway, I wanted to share this with you in case some of you are interested in um, ordering some. So this whole thing came out to, what is it, like, there's tax in California, quite a bit of tax. So it's, I think I paid $30 and does it say? No, but $30 and some odd change. So it's a really great deal. And then for those of you, here's my little tip for you. For those of you who are thinking, you know what, I'm actually going to want to buy more than $30 worth. I would say divide your shipment so that the shipping only comes out to 99 cents because that $5 discount off of 25 or more comes off automatically. So that way each shipment of the $30 or less is just $1 shipment because if you end up buying I think $60, the shipping jumps to like $8.99 if you take that, you know, $5 off, that means you're paying shipping $3.99 for shipping which for the $30 mark would then make it, what, $1.99 for shipping or something like that? Does that make sense? I know my bargain, you know, shopper's <laughs> brain is at work. Anyway, I wanted to quickly share with this with you because I know we have quite a number of house mouse fans out there. And so, yeah, aren't these going to be great for, like, Christmas stocking stuffers? I'm actually looking to use some of these for Easter gifts. So I just wanted to share this with you, though, um, in case some of you want to take a look. And look, there's my new Peanuts Traveler's mug. There's the Jane Austen coaster from M. And then right over here is this beautiful junk journal from Julie that I've been working on steadily. So anyway, um, if you guys like this, certainly thumbs up, like, subscribe, and I'll see you later. God bless. And down in the description bar, I will leave the website. Okay. Hope you guys get some fun shopping done. Take care. Bye.